Hello everyone, I'm an old guy gaming and I have a quick tutorial here for you on how to set up a tree platform here in Ark Survival Ascended. Uh, the tree platform is a little different in Ascended than it was in Ark Survival Evolved and uh, the first thing to know about it is that you can't snap walls to uh, the edge of the platform here and then start building back because it, it won't line up correctly. The, the angles will be all wrong and it'll it, it won't work. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to use foundations and we're going to build out from the center of the trunk uh, to get uh, started with the build here. And I'm just going to show you the very first part so you guys uh, know how to how to get it started and then you can take it from there. OK, so what we're going to do is we're going to come up to this uh, little inside section here where the net is and we're going to grab ourselves a square foundation. And what you want to do is you want to get in a little bit beyond the first row of netting there. So I'm going to get it kind of sort of close to lined up. I'm going to go into the orbital camera here and I'm going to move it this way just a little bit and maybe just a little more right about there. Okay. So if you look at that first row or uh, of squares where the, where the netting is, what you want to do is you want to bring this past the first rope to right about there-ish or so. So um, a, a little way, you don't want it touching the rope, you want it a little ways past the rope. And then from here you just uh, line it up a little bit more and you can use that kind of center beam in the foundation to line it up into with the center net square there and also the, the, uh, the corners. So we're gonna have to move it a couple of pixels to the right and maybe just one more nudge. That's pretty close. We're going to have to make one final adjustment on it, though, too. That's that's actually very close right there. Okay, so we're going to click once, and every time I do that, no matter how still I hold my mouse, it moves it. So kind of a pain in the butt. And then we're going to get back into the normal camera, and we're going to sync it all the way down, and then try and... Once again, line it up as close as possible. Whoops, wrong button. Uh, get back into the orbital camera. It looks like we need to move it uh, that way just a just a touch. And that's looking pretty good right about there. Okay, and then if we back up and just kind of look at the ghost edge of the next platform uh, and line that up with you know the seam, uh, it looks it looks pretty straight. It, it's pretty darn close. Okay, so once we have that in place. Then what we want to do is we want to take three triangle foundations and snap those there, then go back to a square, put one square in, three triangles, one square in, and you just rinse and repeat all the way around. Excellent. Okay, so when you get the first, uh, the first circle done, you want to look at the square foundations and you want to kind of just walk around and see if it's if it's pretty close. Uh, so that one is almost exactly the same as that one. This one's in maybe just a little bit more. That one's in just a little bit more. Um, uh, right here, it's it's really close though. I mean, I I think that's probably pr probably close enough. It's not absolutely perfect, but I I think it's close enough to where it's not going to really be that noticeable if we kind of look at it from the bird's eye view. Too. Again, we're only paying attention to the square foundations um, and seeing how those line up with the beams from the tree platform itself. And it's it's pretty darn close. If, if I wanted to really try and get it absolutely perfect, I could mess with it some more, but I think, I think that's going to be good enough. After you get the first circle in, then what you do is you take your square foundations and you put those this time on the triangle side and you put two down. And then once again, you go along with uh, your triangular foundations. Uh, let's see. Yeah, grab the triangular foundations there. A couple more squares. And it's the same thing. So you put three triangles, but this time two squares. And then three triangles, two squares, and work your way around. And there you go. 
And then from here, you just keep working your way out as far out as you want to come uh, with the foundations based upon, you know, how you're going to build. Um, one other advantage to doing this, aside from the fact that your, you know, your walls and your ceilings and your roof is all going to line up, is it's really easy to accidentally grab the platform itself. And if you grab it and pick it up, the whole thing collapses. And it's a real pain in the butt, you know, once you've started building or if you have other things up here. So that's pretty much it. You guys can take it from here. I hope you guys found this short tutorial useful. I'm an old guy gaming, and we'll catch you later. Bye-bye.